So now that we saved Sully, what what do we what do we do? What are we doing? Come on, this way. Oh. Yeah. Okay. What he said. Thank you, up triangle button or up directional button. Should be this way. That that's what he just said, Nate. Welcome back to some Uncharted 2 Among Thieves. I'm Comic. I'm Pad. And um we had our first deaths. It hurt. Mm -hmm. I think we're at two and one now. Yep. And I have the controller again, so this is my chance to pull behind on you. <laughs> <laughs> I think the dominant strategy of this is just to play as little as possible but the so thing, that you can't die. But the thing, though, is, like, I didn't even do, like, I played through a pretty tough part there. Yeah. So I feel like I'm not, I, I, I didn't, I wasn't just throwing the controller at you to be like, no, nope, not my turn. No, I feel like weren't. I justly deserve that switch. Oh, look at this. It's pretty. It's so pretty. Mm -hmm. See, I know that that entire environment isn't actually, like, explorable, but it feels like it is, and I appreciate that. Like, I feel like I could go walk over there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Would you look at that? Oh, yeah. Hey. Hi. Hello. What do we have here? With any luck, the last resting place of Marco Polo's crew. Oh, uh, do you really think it's going to be that easy, Nate? So. Wow, oh, this place must be thousands of years old. At least. That is, like, a very strong... I thought that was something for a second, because, like, the parts where the sunlight does come mm -hmm. in through here, it's really bright and different colored. I mean, that's how it is in real life, though, this way. Right? I guess. Oh. Looks like we hit the jackpot. Yeah, there must be hundreds of bodies down here. This game has very dark darks and very bright blacks. Oh, oh, oh. Bats. I love bats. I like bats too. Hey, I, think I absolutely me. love bats. They're they're like flying puppies. They their cargo they're adorable. All the way up here after they were shipwrecked. So what do we find here? I've seen this before. Okay, so we light it on fire, or we light a fire. Yes. The red. Sully, give me a light. Ooh. It's like um, blue copper. Wait a minute. Mm -hmm. Or this is blood. I think copper burns Everywhere. green, but I know there's something that Massacre. burns blue. All right, let's follow well, the blood stains. Yeah. Um, see if they lead somewhere. Uh, usually, certain types of gas, like butane. Yeah, probably. Or like like magnesium. When you burn magnesium, it's, it's like the brightest right, thing it ever. you. Yeah. Chemistry's interesting. But I would. Copper is green. That's interesting. I wish I knew more about. Yeah, if you burn a copper wire, it'll burn green for a while. I wish I knew more about chemistry. It was my worst subject. The oh, I was bad with it. I just remember I had this professor named Dr. Krieger, and she was an absolutely oh, yeah. insane. I didn't have Dr. Um, Krieger. She thought she was a German pirate Nazi thing. I don't know. Oh. I, I she have was, her, and I can attest that Pat she, is telling the truth. She was crazy. She was, like... She was off the charts. Yeah, she was out there. She was out there. She would, like, literally make arg pirate noises all the time. And, and like, uh, on her test, she would, like, German. little graphics that would have it there, like, speak in German. Was that her way of, like, relating to the kids? I think like, so. did she think that made her the cool teacher? I, kn I forget who it was in her class, but one of the kids who sat up front, every time she would say arg, he would just kick her desk. <laughs> Oh, and thing up she here. was just weird. And she, I remember she was talking about, we watched this video on, like, the chemistry of swords, and she was gonna, like, talking about how she was gonna bring her husband's katana collection in. <laughs> it's just like, like don't that's, think that's well, allowed, lady. Yeah. That's how you know you're cool Dog. when you own a katana. Well, it's your, it's your husband, her husband, <laughs> I guess. Please don't bring a sword into my class. This moves a little. Sully, help me out. I remember she because I was trying to get my grade better in chemistry I had the mm -hmm. other I had the other she teacher I had Mr. Jones him. oh I heard he was nuts too oh he was fun um, <laughs> but Dr. Krieger did the thing where you know you know the element song the song that has all the elements in it I know that for her class she did a thing where if anybody ever recited the whole thing to her she would give them extra credit and I needed 
I wanted to bring my grade up in chemistry in Mr. Jones's class. So I went to Dr. Krieger and I learned the whole song and I recited it to her. And what do we have here? I said, can you please ask Mr. Jones to give me extra credit? And he freaking didn't. And he was just like, oh, that's that's pretty cool, but no. This is this is a teacher who um this is a teacher who managed to blow a hole in the ceiling during class. Mr. Jones? Yeah. Yeah. He blew a hole in the ceiling. Yes, I was there. Oh, I, I was not there for that. What is it? Some kind of weapon? <laughs> and he was just oh, like he was so nonchalant about everything, and he was just, whenever that's something like that happened, he'd just be like, that, that that's bad. Destroy obstacles. Huh? He had to. You know, spiritual ones. Um, he had to be smoking before yeah, class. Wait, could this be what Marco Polo it's was talking school. about? <laughs> Kids, I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. Uh, one journal, time, do you remember Dave Harrington? Do you ever meet him? Seeker would be um, given a golden or uh, Peter? Yeah. Um, they would screw around in chemistry a lot, and the one time they had like their Bunsen burner turned up like all the freaking way, so there was like, <laughs> so it was like seven foot tall flames, and Mr. Jones just like walks by and he's like, I don't think you're prop practicing proper lab procedure, and then just walked away and like didn't do anything about it. Exquisitely finished temples, hundreds of. Gilded spire stretching as far as it was kind of great because he didn't really try to I teach you. You just do whatever, but then you do terrible yeah. on the test because he didn't teach you anything. Oh, that's not good. Yes. Anymore, it's a city. Well, that could make things a little more challenging. Now, hold on, there's more. In all these many temples, only one conceals the secret path to Shambhala, and that path shall only be revealed to the pilgrim who bears the golden passport. <laughs> oh, right. Oh, it's a passport. So what are we waiting oh. for? Let's get Here, out. I thought it was a dagger. See ya. His funny teeth. Let's get going. Yeah, a little bit. So, I don't know what it is, but Chloe kind of freaks me out. Why? I think it's her eyes. She has eyes like a lynx. Huh. Never thought of that. Like her eyes are just like really bright. Bright. Oh, but she shares my super climbing powers. Yep. She may be better at climbing than you. Oh yeah. See, S Sully needs a hand to do it. He can't do it by himself. Mm -hmm. I mean that that's still impressive God though. Damn it. Come on. You know what it is? Between the accent and being, like, equally good at climbing as us, mm -hmm. she's the human version of Mila from Sly. That's what, I'm, that's what I'm feeling here. Why? Why do you feel that? Because of the accent and being agile and being a double agent. But I guess double agent the other So far, that's how Mila started, too. Oh god, you're right. I don't trust double agents. I, because you never know when they're gonna be triple agents. They came from down there. <sighs> and Mila was like a quintuple agent. Well, she, yeah. She was playing all the angles. Speaking yeah, of you right. She was. She? And she was also a um a British Indian. Like coded British Indian. Pathway to Shambhala. Oh, so is yeah. So so is Chloe. Oh, don't be such a bad. Uh, I think Chloe's from Australia, but yeah, she's Australia Indian. Move. I mean, she's not betraying us right now. She has to act like she's on their side. That's her job. Come on, keep moving. <sighs> Maybe that's why she reminds me of, like, a jumping She almost got shot. Oh, she just got shot. Yeah, she took a bullet for us. She didn't even yeah, well, freaking flinch. More believable. Now I'm going to try and buy you some time. No, Chloe, you have to come Don't get me wrong. She is a badass. Oh. Just meet me in Nepal. Now run. Let's go. I like her. Yeah, I bet you do. <laughs> run. They've spotted us. Man, Elena's gonna be mad if she's in any more of these games. I should not be fighting this guy. Oh. No, I do not want to be punching this guy anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still running and punching. 
<laughs> getting kind of punch drunk there. They spotted us. Run for it. Okay, so my pro tip for you is don't stop and punch that guy. No, what did I say? How did you how did you disengage from punching? I don't know. I don't know. I hit X. I hit jump. I was like locked into punch mode. One punch. No, it was many punches. It was punching Woo. forever. I need to watch one punch man though. Oh, I got, we got Ali and I got into another anime though. It's like the second anime I've ever been really into. What was the first? Uh, oh, I need the, to the, answers. the first was um, Full Metal Alchemist, both versions of it. But My Hero Academia really is actually freaking awesome. And I think I would like One Punch Man, but I haven't watched it. I still think you'd like Psychopaths. I bet I would like Psychopaths. We're gonna get out of this, okay? We always do. I'll tell you what, after we you finish My Hero Academia, we'll go to Psycho Pass, because I think, hey, I, I think this has been back. our entry, <laughs> our oh, entry shit. anime. <laughs> oh, I'm still not into anime, but... You, See, me neither, you know, but, but I like good things. <laughs> Crap, that's his, like, catchphrase. Shit. Crap. Aw, Flynn. Did they get away? Poor oh, Flynn, he doesn't know what the heck he's doing. Head start on us. You weren't kidding. Well, he's had some help oh, we're in Nepal now. The city's been on the brink of I mean, I'm saying the obvious of just what's written on the screen, but yeah, we, we jumped. Charming. Nepal's pretty close yeah, to well, Korea. Well, the chaos provides some cover while he destroys the city looking for the right temple. Very orange, warm hey. color high. Yeah. Hello? Yeah, I'm still here. You're not having second thoughts, are you? Oh, me? Never. Good, because I'm so ready to be done with these clowns. You got a map? Uh, yeah. I'll meet you in the old market. Things are pretty quiet over there. All right, you got it. Uh, uh, that's not going to be quiet. You got company. Oh, great. Can you lose them? I think it might be too late for that. Oh, no, it's the truck from Sonic Adventure 2. It's huge. Follow me. Oh no, there goes Trust a spare. Me. <laughs> what happens if he hits a flat tire? <laughs> We're screwed. We don't have AAA out here. <laughs> We're just triple B. <laughs> See, look at this. Look at this, like, completely different kind of environment now that wasn't in the first Oh god! <laughs> oh man. Trust me, you need to escape from the city. <laughs> this really is that. This is that part from Sonic Adventure 2. But if you had a gun, oh, I wish I could have done that to that truck. And stay dead. <laughs> wow. You did not like that truck. I wasn't expecting it. <laughs> okay. What if the second truck comes? <laughs> you killed my truck, husband. <laughs> I think more scenes need to just randomly oh, insert no. sudden trucks. Oh man. Oh, we're getting another stealth. Oh, stealth time. It's the time. Is the... Oh, what? Oh, you're here to witness a scene. Ooh. What the heck? <laughs> I guess this game's a lot more exciting than the last one. Oh my god, it is. Was that was that Chloe? Maybe. Or or is this just like the civil war around here? Well, I mean, look at the street. Yeah. Oh my god. You get to throw propane tanks. Oh, you still have to shoot them. Well, you you did destroy the propane tank, so good job. <laughs> Ten bullets. I, I'm not sure if these guys are your enemies or if just everything's so destabilized around here that they attack anyone. Uh, 
I was hoping that grenade would kill that guy. <laughs> I thought you were going to say I was hoping that grenade would kill you. You know, a small part of me is hoping that too. Oh, Pat, I came so, so close I'm to I'm so sorry. It's fine, I'm still in the lead. Okay. So let's, uh... I'm gonna do this semi-stealth-like. That's your neck. Oh, wow. That actually works. Nobody... Holy crap. Go get him. <laughs> I'm him. doing the piggyback technique. Man, this guy still hasn't noticed. Do, 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 do. Oh. Yeah, we gotta get pinned out on that. What? What? You got your arm. I know, but I mean, I, I guess I don't really get what to do in these situations. Okay. Okay. Just right, you just gotta be street smart. Let's see who our uh, bus wielding friend is. Dead. Very dead. Oh. Boss, I thought we were friends. Well, I guess I'm not going that way. Okay, then. That's some good conveyance game. No. So which way are we going, Nate? Can we come in here? I guess I should... I guess I should actually, like, pick up equipment... I mean, you already have enough ammo. Yeah. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty well prepared. Need more grenades. Um. There. Yeah. Where is that where we came from? We didn't really come from anywhere. Yes, we, we just... Came. Oh, yeah. We definitely came... We definitely did come from somewhere. Yeah, that's your defeated foe. His metal carcass. Can we climb up... No. On this thing? No. Now? Okay, so we can't go the bus way. The the bus is out at sure. I'll take the hint. Get me up there. Oh, the street sign. That, yeah, that's obvious. Yeah, that hadn't occurred to me. I mean, it is yellow. Well, yeah, but that's so that traffic will take heed of it. Um. Okay, jumping to pipe. Oh, you need to get higher. Okay. Oh. Yeah, things you need to climb are kind of like brighter bricks. colors. Grab the bricks. Yeah. Or jutting out at weird angles. Move, pigeons. X to vault over wall. It's not a wall, it's a sign, you silly. It's both. Uh. Uh oh. Okay, cool. Um, I think we need to get an inspector in here. The floor's a little uneven. Oh, um, yeah, okay, okay, John, Mr. Engineer. That's me. It's fine. The floor is fine. Oh, yeah, this is... This is not it's up to It's fine. Code. OSHA is gonna have a field what? day with this. It'll be fine. No one lives here anyway. Of course not. Look at this place. I know, some housewife was like, Oh, yeah, we could totally flip a house. And look where it led us. It's like those people from HDTV who are looking for a house, right? Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> I'm a stay-at-home artist, and I'm a toenail seller. Um, our budget is $3 million. I love HGTV. It's so fake. <sighs> I love those, like documentaries or like family reality shows whatever where they're like see how this family is just like yours except we're gonna pay for them to go to all these weird vacation spots because watching them in their house every day is gonna be boring my mom used to watch that uh john and kate plus eight all the time i have not and that's like that. that's like all it ever was was like the studio pay okay. for them to go on some weird vacation oh there we go I, I was working on my on my abs, or no, not my abs, on my um, arms. What's what's the muscle it's in the pecs. arms? Deltoids. Your pecs. Okay. That's what you're working on with the deltoids. Holes. Biceps. See, I, I don't have any, so I don't remember what to call them. 
triceps. No, you have them. I, I have. I have sticks of marshmallow attached to my shoulders. Oh, that's you. Okay. More stealthing. I like these masks, though. Let's just... Okay. And we can... I like the color palette quietly. in this area. Me too. That was... I feel like that should have been louder to other people, but okay. You just punched him unconscious. That, that punch had sound to it, though. Alright. What was that, like, ninja symbol there? I don't know. I think it's saying that I only got it because I stealth killed. Like, I think it gives you more stuff if you kill with stealth. Hmm. Kind of like how an RPG No, because it took one of your grenades. You had three. Oh. What? Yeah. Wait, what took one of my grenades? The ninja thing. Unless it's like a trap. How does it take one of my grenades? It's a dead body. Well, what if you put one in the body? Why would I do that? It's so when other people come over, it blows up. I mean, that's not how that works, but... Okay, I feel pretty good about that. Oh, okay, no, this game is, like, smarter because... Even though I threw grenades, they don't know where it came from. They kind of have a general... Oh. Now they do. Now they do, because I stupidly jumped out of cover. Okay. Alright. Uh, somebody to my left more, too. Uh, no, that's not good. Alright. Wow, this color palette's getting a lot redder. No! <laughs> Here, I don't know what was happening there. You're an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> you can put it down. Patty actually handed me a beer. <laughs> Not. <laughs> this is bullcrap. <sighs> What's this? That is gun. See, it's especially sad to me because you had to replay through the parts that I did make progress on. Like, I threw some good grenades. <laughs> just punch. Just deck him. I'm just saying, Nate has really quiet punches. He's very quiet everything. <laughs> what kind of shoes does he have? Quiet ones. Sneakers. Does it? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> you okay? I'm so happy! I just... See, I like when I accidentally set up a pun. That wasn't accidental, that was deliberate. So I didn't do it. It wasn't deliberate Oh, on when my you part. set up. Okay. See, maybe I was manipulated into setting it up, but... No, I didn't... I, 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 didn't, I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't try. I realized it after you said it and just said it. That's the best kind of pun. What, when you just realize when, that it's a pun it just, and then you say it When it, it just it happens works? out of... Yeah, when it just happens out of conversation. That's the kind of thing that would have pissed Oscar off. Yeah, he would have been really mad. That's like his least favorite thing. Oh, that's the best though. So you got an Uzi. I kind of like just jumped out of my pocket. Kind of did, yeah. I'm very excited. Uh oh, that guy's. Oh, a they shield. got they got shields. That doesn't look fun. And they can. I can thrill like Derek Jeter. What kind of gun pose is this? That's... I, I don't Awkward. even know. That is really... It's kind of like Shonen. Oh, yeah, what are we going to do about him? That was pretty awesome. Oh, you can take the shield? 
That's amazing! Here we go. Oh, this game is so cool! I did not know you could do that. That's awesome. Probably, like, can only take a certain amount of abuse. Well, I mean, I can't use a long gun. Oh, that makes sense, too. Oh, why? Another truck. I told you there'd be another <laughs> one. <laughs> Did you see that? Oh, damn. Okay, yeah, sure, having you fun survived with that, that sure. <laughs> yeah, grenade to the face, not a huge deal. It's kind of like how in every Captain America movie there's somebody with a machine gun who just, like, what? for some reason fires what? it right into... What? Oh. Okay. <sighs> Seems like I am always saving your ass. Well, it is an ass worth saving. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh. Is that an ancient Tibetan ritual dagger in your pocket? Well, maybe I'm just happy to see you. I cannot mm. handle these two. Yeah, hello. Why? <laughs> hello. This is the key to everything. Yes, it is. Marco Polo's passport to Shamba. This treasure. What do we do with it? Ah, I have no idea, actually. I do know Lazarevich won't get very far without it. I wouldn't underestimate him, you know. He and Flynn have been tearing this city apart. They must have leveled dozens of temples already. So what's our next move? Nate? I hate it when you do that. Is this the safest place to, like, you're out in the Check open where you were just fighting a bunch of bad symbol? guys. I feel yeah. like you should be on the move. Look up there. Okay, I see the resemblance, so what does it mean? It means we know how Marco Polo found his next clue. The temple we're looking for is going to be marked with this emblem. Now all we have to do is find it. <laughs> You do realize there are literally hundreds of these temples throughout the city. Yes, yeah, but we need the one with that emblem on it. We could spot our needle in the haystack. Right. There's a hotel not far from here. <laughs> Chloe, now is not the time. It's easily the tallest building in the city. <laughs> I do like these two's banter. Right. Well, okay. That's uh, that's good thinking. Follow me. <laughs> you know he was totally yeah. Not thinking that. I mean, maybe we'll find Shambhala, or maybe we'll just sleep together. Oh, Either way, Drake's happy. Alright, well, next time we will it's no good. find our temple. It's locked. Wait here. I'll see if I can find a way around. Or I could just, like, blast it the hell open, but okay. Alright, till then, I'm Comic. See ya.